Hi, Jazzy Greens. And if you are new, my name is Liz. And today I am sharing my fall fireplace decor challenge 2021. This is a collaboration that is hosted by Creatively Miss Me with Stephanie and her co-host is Debbie Bubbles. Now they wanted us to decorate our fireplace for the fall, but we must use at least one acorn. And I tell you, I was on the hunt to find one and we're gonna see, did I find one or not? But anyway, please check out these ladies' channels. You will be blessed and subscribe to their channels and watch the playlist. And that link will be down in my description box. Okay guys, here is my fall fireplace 2021. And I'm so excited for this because I really like the way I decorate it. So let me go ahead and give you an overview and then we'll go into the details. Okay, starting on the wall, of course, I have my beautiful octagon mirror that always sits here. <laughs> then I have a really cute fall wreath, and I love that wreath. I like it so much. It's so pretty. Just look at the nice berries on it. So, so pretty. So, so fall. Then over to the right and the left, I have my wall sconces. And inside I have these really beautiful gold pumpkins. Now I really like the fact that I use these because they're very shiny and they're glam. And to me it looks like I have candles inside of them, but I don't, just pumpkins. So I think that's really pretty. Okay, then coming down onto the mantle. I'm gonna start off to the right. I have a lantern. I have one on the other side as well. And I forgot to turn the light on. And then I have these white, very pretty, um, what are these flowers called? I'm always using them and I forget the name of them. Hydrangea flowers. These are so, so pretty. I just love to use them. Mainly because that they're pure white and they're just very, pretty to use in any style, any season really to me. And here's the other one on the other side, some more flowers. Okay, then I just have some leaves that are kind of draped around, laying there tightly secure, at least I try to. Some of them try to fall, but I, you know, did the best I could. So I have different color leaves. I have some pine cones. And there are my tea lights. I have three of those. And a gather sign that I love so much. It's so, so pretty. I just love the color of it and the letters of it. Then I have a little, this is called a pick little floral pick. So that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> then over here I have a uh, fall leaf can candle burning and this smells really, really nice. I love the fact that it has the fall leaf on the outside of it. Really pretty color leaves, especially that red burgundy color. I just love fall. I tell you, I love fall because of the colors and the season changing, the weather, oh, it's just so nice. There's another pine cone there. And then I have these three different uh, picks that I tucked in here. These are gold. This one is like an amber, uh, more like a reddish color leaf feathers, these are feather leaves, and here is the gold one here. You probably can't tell too much on camera, but they're very shimmery and shiny. And they sparkle too, you probably can't tell, maybe you can, but the camera does not do them justice. And 
and then going down here are my um, I don't know what you call these but my fireplace stakes is what I'm calling them because I don't know the actual name of it then over here down on the bottom right I have a lantern here and I have some fall flowers I've got some different flowers and picks acorn not acorn but I have a um, all that in there of course a candle burning some leaves and a pine cone in there I have a succulent sitting right there and a nice pumpkin that says fall is in the air and then okay here is my acorns sitting in this cute tray here I didn't want to just put one so I thought I would just put a few of them in that little tray there I thought it was really cute Here's some more lanterns here. Over there in the corner is the other one. And another candle inside that little jar there, which I forgot to light up. And then laying on the floor of this, I have stretched out my... Um, my uh, fall runner. This is actually a runner. So I just wanted to put that there to give it a little more of a pop of fallish. And it has owls on it. So cute. How cute is that? And that's how I styled my fireplace and mantle for the fall. So I hope you guys like it. I have to say that I like it. I'm happy the way it turned out. Stephanie and Debbie, thank you so much for hosting this challenge for us. I really appreciate it. If you're new here, welcome. I am so glad to have you. And if you have not yet joined the Jazzy Green family, please click on that subscribe button. Give me a big thumbs up and give me a comment down below. And I welcome you into the family. Thank you so much. To all my faithful family members, you guys know how I feel. I love and appreciate all of you so much. But you know what? Before I let you go, I forgot to mention that I've got some cutie pies right here. Some cute pumpkins as well. There's an, um, I forgot the name of this. Someone told me what that is. But you see it there all my different pumpkins and my cute trucks is one over there with pumpkins in it and here is the other one but anyway you guys thank you so much for watching this video you guys take care be blessed and of course i will see you next time in my next video happy fall you guys bye bye